What up, what up, what up? The Caribbean Globe presents your weekly entertainment league. Check out the scoop we have coming. But before you do that, remember to click like and subscribe. See you. Yes, we are back with the scoop and um, we start off with the king of the dance hall, Beanie Man. And um, I, trust me, it, it was a sight to see him ooh and ah, you know, his cute little baby um, with Crystal Tomlinson. And speaking of Crystal, <laughs> social media is lighting up, I mean lighting up that she could be pregnant and having another one in the oven, but hey, um, it's nothing going, it's something coming. So if it is true, you would know. But whatever the case, it's their life. And um, and if it is true, then big up. Um, just another one, family first. Mavado wants back his custom Nike shoes. <laughs> really and truly now, a whole thief Mavada custom Nike shoes. Bring it back and don't let the DJ get crass and miserable. Mavada posted the image of his shoes on his Instagram account as he made the call for its return. Check out the post. Someone stole my shoes and I want it back, okay? This shoes here is a part of history. It was when Nike first recognized dancehall music and how great I am. So I want it back at a Safa Sub 10 King. Anyways, you can't say the man never beg for him shoes. The DJ don't have any plans to part with it. So stop eating and bad mind and bring back the shoes. Me done. DJ spit into toll booth operator face. What kiss me neck back? I was really a going in a dance hall down in Jamaica. Did I just read that a DJ by the name of Sadiki spit in a toll booth operator face? He looks so. Cause him get charged for come on assault for this disgusting act. The poor girl who works at the Portmore toll booth must tired for wash her face by this. Ew! But more about what happened. According to the police reports, the incident happened a few weeks ago when the DJ pulled up to the toll booth and an argument developed with, with him and the female toll operator. During the argument, the selector allegedly spat in the woman's face. The disc jack appeared in the St. Catherine Parish Court on Friday, September 20, and was fined 5,000 or 10 days in prison. He was also ordered to make an open apology to the victim in, in court. Chow back foot. Anyways, guys, I'll be back next week with more entertainment scoop. Peace out.